Welcome to my second video. This is about the solar project. Um, just an update really. So I've made a new control panel, a bigger piece of wood, um, and it's changed quite a lot. I got rid of a switch that was at the top left. Didn't need that. I've put a new little monitor in there to see how much power and voltage etc we're drawing. There's a new fuse box here for a consumer unit. In the right there you can see there's a new there's a new fuse. That's um an RCBO, so it's a six amp MCB with an R C D unit. So that's new. That's that's um what comes out of the inverter. So the one next to it is the one that goes into the inverter, forty amp MCB. The one on the right is the RCBO which comes from the inverter. There's the inverter, which wasn't on the previous board. 24 volt, 600 watt inverter. Um, and obviously that goes to the switch, the socket. The charge controller I haven't done anything with. Um, I've also got these two. Little connector blocks. Um, just to wire the battery banks together really. Instead of wiring them together using these, I've got two batteries in series like that, and then each of those banks are in parallel. So I've got the two banks. I've still got the two banks at the minute. I've got another another two banks to go there, but I'm waiting for some of these terminal block connector things to arrive. So I've got the wire, but I'm waiting for those. Um, I need to check the fluids on these as well to make sure they're right. So there are the updates. I've also tested it with my PC and run my PC for an hour or two and it worked per perfectly. Um, you can see where it's currently charging at here. It's bringing 110, sorry, 111 volts in at 1 amp. It's charging those at 29.2 volts at 4 amps. And as you can see, it's a pretty crap day. However, regardless of it being crap, there you go. Um, it's doing really well. So, my batteries are getting charged up there. And then you can hear them bubbling away. I don't know if you can hear that on the camera, but but they are bubbling away. So I'll just show you the output now. So there's no, there's no mains. That cable there goes to earth, by the way. Uh, that does go into the mains, but only the earth um, core, only the earth core is plugged in. The other two are dead, so that goes to earth. Anyway, I'm going to show you this thing working now. Um, I've tested it with the PC. But it's not easy for me to bring the PC in here, so I'm going to try out this radio. Make sure this is switched on. It is. Switch this on. It's taking zero watts, that's not right. I think this will kick in in about a minute. See that's working from the solar. What's up with that though? Why is that saying zero watts of volts? Uh, zero watts. Why is it zero watts? Turn it off. 
turn it back on. Hmm. Well, my meter's not working, but obviously it's working. I tried my PC on it, and that worked perfectly. Put the monitors on, but it didn't work perfectly. So the next test really is to see how long this can last for with my PC or something. Turn it off now. I've also got to do some more jobs on these as well. These have currently got a new electrolyte in, a magnesium sulfate electrolyte. Just to clear them up really and get them back up to speed to restore them. These ones need, I need to check the water level in these. And then these can go on as well. These need to have the original electrolyte put back in really. Um, sulfuric acid. Anyway, thanks for watching.